GE Range Model PK7000EJES Repairs GE PK7000EJES Wall Oven Make family dinners and special occasions simple with this wall oven that features convection technology for speedy cook times and a generous 4.3 cubic feet capacity WI. Wi-Fi Connect allows you to control the oven from your mobile device. Repairs For the home, kitchen and beyond, GE manufactures appliances that homeowners have come to trust. Even a trustworthy appliance requires occasional maintenance or repair. However, if you're in need of GE appliance repair from experienced professionals, your local appliance helper can help. GE Oven Not Heating Igniter The igniter is the most commonly defective part for an oven not heating. The igniter has two main functions. First, the igniter draws electrical current through the oven safety valve to open it. Second, the igniter gets hot enough to glow and ignite the gas in the oven burner. If the igniter gets weak, it will fail to open the safety valve correctly. If the valve does not open, the oven will not heat. To determine if the igniter is defective, observe the igniter when the oven is on. If the igniter glows for more than 90 seconds without igniting the gas flame, this indicates that the igniter is too weak to open the valve. If the igniter is weak, replace it. If the igniter does not glow at all, use a multimeter to test the igniter for continuity. If the igniter does not have continuity, replace it. GE oven doesn't bake evenly. Bake element. If the bake element is burned out, the oven will only be heated by the broil element. This will cause the oven to heat unevenly. When the bake element is heating properly, it glows red hot. If the element does not glow red, this indicates that the element is not heating. Often, if the element has burned out, it will be visibly damaged. Inspect the bake element for holes or blisters. To determine if the bake element has burned out, use a multimeter to test the element for continuity. If the bake element does not have continuity, replace it. GE oven broiler not working. Broil element. The broiler element may have burned out. When the broil element is heating properly, it glows red hot. If the element does not glow red, this indicates that the element is not heating. Often, if the element has burned out, it will be visibly damaged. Inspect the broil element for holes or blisters. To determine if the broil element has burned out, Use a multimeter to test the element for continuity. If the broil element does not have continuity, replace it. GE stove heating element not working. Surface element board. The surface element board has relays that regulate the power supply to the burners. If one or more of the relays fails, the surface element won't work. If two or more burners fail at the same time, this indicates that the surface element board is likely at fault. If only one surface element won't work, use a multimeter to test the element for continuity. If the surface element has continuity, the surface element board might be defective. GE stove burner won't light. Spark module. The spark modules provides power to each surface burner spark electrode. If the burner is produces a weak spark, or if the burner sparks intermittently, the spark module might be defective. Before replacing the spark module, first check the spark electrode and the spark wire. If the spark electrode and spark wire are not at fault, the spark module is likely defective. If the spark module is defective, replace it. GE oven temperature not accurate. Bake element. When the bake element is heating properly, it glows red hot. If the element does not glow red, this indicates that the element is not heating. Often, if the heating element has burned out, it will be visibly damaged. Inspect the heating element for holes or blisters. To determine if the bake element has burned out, use a multimeter to test the element for continuity. If the bake element does not have continuity, 
Replace it. GE oven light is out. Light assembly. If the oven light is out, the entire light assembly may need to be replaced. Often the light assembly components are not sold separately. GE oven won't turn on. Bake element. When the bake element is heating properly, it glows red hot. If the element does not glow red, this indicates that the element is not heating. Often, if the heating element has burned out, it will be visibly damaged. Inspect the heating element for holes or blisters. To determine if the bake element has burned out, use a multimeter to test the element for continuity. If the bake element does not have continuity, replace it. GE oven not self-cleaning. Door lock motor and switch assembly. During the oven's self-cleaning cycle, the door lock switch activates the door lock motor to prevent the oven door from being opened. If the door lock motor and switch assembly is defective, the oven door will not unlock once the self-cleaning cycle is complete. On most ovens, you can open the oven door by removing certain screws or panels. Check your owner's manual for further instructions.